the playoffs. So here we go. This game is to make the playoffs, and if the Bucks also lose, we win the division as well. So basically, if we win today and the Bucks lose, not only do we secure a wild card spot, we also secure a division title. Here we go to start the game. The Lions do not have a bad offensive line. They're pretty good with their offensive line. But the issue is their throwing. So, the Panthers have got to be prepared for them to run. Now, here we go. There's a first down. Here we go. Once again, it's swift. And second and two. Second and two. Eight yards the tally on that first down run. Here's second and two. Here we go. Here's the first carry for Northwestern. And it's another first down. Justin Jackson. Here we go. And he's going to lose two yards, second and 12. Here we go. And he's taken down third and six. Here we go. They're going to throw it. And he's taken down. But it's a first down first. Here we go. Here we go. And that's six yard. No, five yards. Second and five. Christmas Eve here in 2022. Here we go. But we will have, ready for this, a triple header of action on Christmas Day tomorrow. Tomorrow's Christmas Day. It's Christmas Eve. The Panthers luckily didn't have to play, so they get to spend time with their family tomorrow. And they go second and two. Grab the leftovers and sit back and watch the Chargers and the Colts from Indianapolis. Here we go. Throwing again on second. Intercepted by the Panthers. The Panthers could not score. So here is the kick. He brought it four times in the loss last week as he gets this one away here. He put it four times in the loss last week. The Lions cannot be sure, too sure though. They got to face a good defense still. So here we go. And three yards, second and seven. And that's the end of the first quarter. Here we go. And he's taken down. Going to be held at the line of scrimmage. Third and seven. Here we go. So seven yards from the first down here as they come up to the line of scrimmage. And he gets the first down. TJ Hawkinson. Here we go. And they're going to throw it. And he fumbles it. The Panthers recover. Oh, my. Here we go. 
makes you wonder what's going on with this team because a lot of times we can attribute it to nerves, but maybe it's a lack of focus. Maybe it's and the more trying to break game. through. He's going to get to the 20. 47 yards there. Here we go. And Higgins cannot score. First and goal. Here we go. And McCaffrey can't get in. So there was no gain. Second and goal. Intercepted. Here we go. And another fumble, and the Panthers recover it. And now the Panthers looking to score here for the first touchdown of the game. And he just jumped and picked that one. Gonna get a little past the 10. First and 10. Here we go. The Lions could not score. They're gonna punt back. Christian McCaffrey deep for Carolina. Yeah, last week in the loss, five punts as he gets this one away. And gets past the 30. Here we go. This Carolina offense at the line, ready to go. First and ten, Mayfield. Now on the run, he'll throw it back. And Moore catches that for the first score of the game. Touchdown, Panthers. DJ Moore's DJ Moore's ninth touchdown of the year. And I mean, look at that one-handed. Makes it look like it's nothing. Boom. Unreal. Panthers have the ball. I mean, Detroit Lions have the ball now. That's a timeout. Here we go. Second and two. Taken down. There's another timeout. I do believe that. Nope, they have one timeout left. 53 seconds left. Here we go. Almost intercepted. Second and ten. Here we go. Jackson catches it six yards. Here we go, third and four. And he catches that. Are they going to use a timeout? No, they're not. Here we go. And it's play action. Intercepted! Dante Jackson. Here we go. Panthers have the ball in the third quarter. They're winning 7 to 0. This has been a low scoring game so far. And he's not going to get it. Second and 10. Would have been a big hitter if they had connected. Instead, it's second down. Here we go. Moore catches that one. First and ten. Here we go. Play fake. Mayfield. And no good. Knocked away. And oh, the Lions have somebody injured. Here we go. Completion on first down. They'll throw again. Here's Mayfield. No, he can't catch it. Third and ten. Here we go. Third and ten after back 
back-to-back incompletions. To throw Mayfield. He's going to look deep for more. Moore can't hold on. Fourth and ten. And now the Lions are going to get it. And it's a touchback. Lions couldn't score, so now here's the kick back. This is the second time he punts it away. And it's a touchback. <sighs> Here we go. And old school coaches don't necessarily mind that. Didn't turn it over, right? Didn't create a big play for the other team. Christian McCaffrey wide open. Here we go. The Panthers. Touchdown. Christian McCaffrey. And now they're up by two drop. Two possessions. Baker Mayfield has found the open man twice for the touchdown. First DJ Moore, now Christian McCaffrey. And now Lions are punting back again. Here now the punter Fox as he sends this one away. This is taken at about the And McCaffrey's just gonna get it to the 20. Panthers couldn't score. So here is a punt back. And it goes out. Here we go. It's a good situation right now for the Panthers. It's looking like they're going to win. They're going to make the playoffs. 100%. Second and five. Here we go. And we don't know what's happening with the Bucks right now, but they could be losing, and then that would be the case where they get a division title. Speaking of the Bucks, next week we face the Bucks. So if we end up if the Bucks win this week, I will show that game. If not, then you'll understand why I didn't make the video. Second and four, six yards. Here we go. And taken down. That's a first down. Here we go. And first down. Tampa Bay hasn't even had their game yet. Hasn't even started it. So. And second and four. Here we go. Are they going to pass it? They're going to pass it. And that's a first down. Golf has actually been pretty good today. He's 20 for 25 that's uh, very impressive I mean elite quarterbacks struggle doing that sometimes so does that mean Jared Goff an elite quarterback that's a first and goal but does this mean that Jared Goff is an elite quarterback I mean <laughs> questions to wonder here we go Looks like they're going to throw it here. And they will. And they go. He... Oh my God. He dropped it. Second and goal. What just happened? That was a touchdown. There you go. This time he catches it. Chark Jr. Touchdown Detroit. And they're going to kick it back to them. Questioning why they didn't go for an onside kick. But okay, they are the Lions. First and ten. Here we go. McCaffrey has not run. I don't think he's ran yet. We have not had a run play all game, I don't believe. I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure. There's a first down. Higgins is injured. Oh, no. 
That's a, a big loss. And they use a timeout. Here we go. The rookie Hutchinson with that tackle. His only tackle of the game so far. They'll try and burn some clock McCaffrey yeah, gets a first down and the Lions use another timeout. Their second timeout there. Here we go. Now the, they're going to probably use their final timeout here. That's four yards, second and six. Now the defense will burn their third and final timeout as they'll get it with just over 90 seconds to go in the ball game. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. Here we go. And that's a first down. Seven rushes, 47 yards, seven, an average of seven yards per rush right now. McCaffrey, six yards, second and four. Here we go. And now they are waiting. This is what they did uh, week 11 with the no not week 11 um week nine with the Bengals when they were about the Bengals had a chance to win with like two minutes left they would just hold the ball until the very last second when they had to snap it McCaffrey. and first down McCaffrey that's it Panthers win they are going to the playoffs congratulations to the Panthers going to push him back but these days how hard must it be to be an offensive lineman it's very hard Brandon you've got defensive linemen flinching trying offensive to linemen crowds, and just so many now they have to run it defense now that you have to deal with each week but through it all these guys just sit in there for four quarters and that's it clock over Panthers win and they are going to the playoffs if the Bucks win, you'll see the game next week. If not, you'll see the first game of the wild card, which is supposed to be against the Bucks right now. So anyways, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Goodbye.